If a ship is unlawfully dumping, if they're putting their oil in the ocean and that ship comes to the United States, there are records aboard most ships that are going to allow criminal investigators to piece the crime together. This officer is going to review your chart and some other bridge items. And okay. I'm going to review the uh, oil record book. Okay. The oil record book that they maintain on board, it's really to show where oil's going from the time that they take it on board the vessel to the time it's off. It's like following the money. So we want to follow the oil. We want to make sure that every, just about every ounce of that oil is accounted for. Obviously nobody's writing down, we're dumping overboard today. One of the early cases that I prosecuted was Royal Caribbean. One of the largest cruise ships in the world, cruise lines in the world. And the Norwegian engineers had a name for this book. They called it the Eventerbach, which in Norwegian meant the fairy tale book. Because it was a book of lies. It wasn't the book of the truth. And when you come to the United States, this is a condition of port entry. You can't have a ship that doesn't have this book. So if you come here, and your oil record book has been falsified. It's missing all the overboard dumping. It doesn't have it in here. The people who are responsible for that will go to jail. And the company that's responsible for that is gonna pay a huge fine. Yeah, it is over almost 12 hours. 